congratulations on the film. Thank you so uh, much. Uh, this is a laugh riot, I have to say. Tell me about the experience of, of making this film with all these amazing people. Yeah, I mean, I was just having the time of my life. I felt like I'd won a competition, to be honest. Um, I just had been a fan of so many of the cast for so long, and it was a laugh riot making it as much as it was to watch. Yeah. Tell me about the experience. Uh, I always love the beach scenes, yes. and you guys obviously have some beach scenes. Is fish and chips better down at the seaside than it is in London? It is. I don't think I actually had fish and chips when we were filming, but I already know that that is true. That's, that's the yeah, I'm, yeah. Always, I'm, always, I'm always curious because sometimes if the fish and chips aren't good down by the seaside. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, tell me about what drew you to your your character because she's part of this crazy, crazy thing that's going on, and she's she's friends and doesn't quite know what what the truth is. Um, I think. The fact that she's kind of so obsessed with Edith, I just found quite funny. Um, she's kind of a bit pathetic in the beginning. She just like thinks Edith is perfect and is kind of wowed. And I guess in that time, it would kind of be like Edith was a celebrity. Um, so I think she likes that proximity. And then I like that she slowly realizes what's going on and kind of stays true to what she knows is happening and doesn't just go with the easier option. Yeah. What's the game that you guys play? Is that the, 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 the game, the ge there's a game, isn't there, that you guys play at the, the women's, what, 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 it, what is the women's whist game? What is it? I'm so, I was so curious as to what was it, what it was. Was it poker? Was it rummy? It's the, it's the vibe of um, bridge, maybe? Okay. Yeah, yeah. I think we were going to get taught it and then it just got too confusing, so. Tia so just, just cut off the table, so you didn't have to know. Uh, in terms of working with Olivia and Jesse and all these amazing guys, what's the thing you learnt working with them? Because there's not just them, but all these amazing kind of young actors, Alicia Weir and these seasoned actors. I mean, what was the, what was the lesson you learnt or the, the, first, the big lesson you learnt from this? Um, I don't know. I think I thought I was going to learn loads from Olivia and actually she's just so... She'll just like chat away and then they'll say action and she'll do the most incredible emotive performance. So I learned nothing actually. <laughs> it's really unhelpful. What you will learn tonight is this is an amazing cinema, like a communal experience that people should go to the cinema yes. and see. How important is it for you guys as actors that the films that you make where possible can be shown on the big screen because it feels like it's been lacking a little yeah. bit in the last couple of years. Yeah, it's really important. I think like I always like watching stuff in the cinema. Just it's just nice to like immerse yourself in something which I mean you can do it at home, it's just not the same. Like you have the ability to pause it and to get up and it's just nice to kind of like escape and forget the world. Um, so I think it's yeah as much as possible going to the cinema is ideal. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey you guys! <laughs> hey you guys! <laughs> hey, that's what they all say. Hey you guys! Hey you guys!